Hi guys, today we're going to be looking at hacks on how to deal with the heat when playing netball. Okay, so first thing is to get yourself some uh, dryer sheets, some more dryer sheets, and you can just put these in your bag. It smells lovely. Put it in your bag and put all your sweaty clothes and all the smells coming from your trainers. It will absorb the smell and it will freshen up your bag as well. So just get one of these and put it in. Next thing is to make sure you use ice in your water bottle just to make sure that it stays cool because nobody wants to drink warm water and it'll be a lot more refreshing if you put some ice cubes in it. If the nozzle is really thin on your water bottle then put a little bit of water in the bottle, put it horizontally in the fridge freezer and let it freeze overnight and then you've got a, a perfect ice cube in that water bottle ready for the next day. The next thing I would say is to make sure you bring a change of clothes because you might not always be able to have a shower but after training, after um, a tournament, you might want to get changed before you sit back in the car because if you're anything like me and you sweat a lot then you're not going to enjoy sitting on a seat and putting all the sweat from your clothes onto the seat. So I'd bring a change of clothes. I've got a really helpful tip of how to um, fold your clothes up so that it doesn't take much room in your bag, which I'll show you now. to put in your bag that doesn't take up much room and you can change after a sweaty session so that you're not getting all the seats sweaty in the car and you don't have to sit there in your own sweat on your journey home. Okay, last thing I would make sure you do is get yourself a I want to say carabiner, don't know if that's right, so hopefully it's not so wrong, carabiner, Caribbean, I don't know, carabiner clip, um, they're just like the little clips that you see like, on rock climbing and stuff um, and you want to put hair bubbles on it so that you've got hair bubbles during your session because there's nothing worse than doing your session and your hair bubble breaks or your hair's a bit loose and then you've got sweaty hair stuck to your face nobody wants that so get yourself a caribbean clip put some bubbles on it i'll show you how. so one of these clips that you can just clip onto your bag put all your bubbles on it you can take it off get get a bubble out done and then i just will clip that onto my rucksack and there you have it. 